Are you a model? Do you want to be a model? Well, no, <laughs> I want to be a uh, president. What really makes me feel ugly or not enough or too much is the gaze. The male gaze in general is not something I feel comfortable with at all. This white supremacist, sex repressive, totalitarian colonial gaze. I was never the kind of girl that I felt guys would be attracted to because I wasn't blonde and had straight hair and was super skinny, European type. I would link everything to my body. Oh, I just dropped a plate. Oh, bad body. Life will be better when I have a good body. Women wouldn't worry about our bodies all the time. We could change the world like this. I know, first of all, why I don't open up these magazines because they only make you feel ugly and bad. I worked for 10 years at Elle. I had covered this trial, a young boy who had been killed by the police. The minute we were supposed to send the pages, suddenly my boss arrives. Oh, look, there is this keychain from Fendi. You really have to put it somewhere. Oh, you know what? We're gonna put it there. It's a very hard, macho world where you need to be somebody that is able to laugh about stupid jokes about uh, women, pornographic things, investment bankers uh, type of guys. They send them to each other like the whole day. I think there is also something about the women condition that is always shameful. Sex is bad, sex is dangerous, you can get pregnant and you can get sick. Why is there so much shame and fear and guilt around this? I thought I have to act according my gender. One day I feel a bit more dudish, <laughs> another day I feel more girly. I told my, uh, my other brothers that I was gay and they stopped the car and wanted to, to fight me. There is no men and women, we're all equal. There is no black and white, we're all equal. Women are getting less paid and black men are being killed by the policemen, so no, we're not equal. The most difficult is to say I have value. I am valid and that value is not because of the job that I have, it's not what, because of the clothes that I'm wearing, it's not uh, next to who am I sitting. I have value in myself because I'm alive and I have kept myself alive, I have value. I am 73, I have still a lot of fun when the choice was uh, funny and interesting and secure, but uh, less interesting. Okay, I have always choice, risk. It's a work of life, yeah. I think it's uh, even uh, in 30 years I will not totally self-accept me. I hope so. I'm going to give you a hug. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>